Looking ahead, tomorrow, Arkansas lawmakers will be back at the state capitol for the 2024 fiscal session. Fox 24's Christina Randall talked with local lawmakers about the big topics they expect will be discussed. Governor Sarah Huckabee Sanders is sending her first budget to Arkansas representatives and senators to vote on. She's asking those lawmakers to greenlight her $6.3 billion proposed budget. All we do is we take a look at the state budget and see if there are any changes that need to be made. According to Democrat State Senator Greg Ledding, a major topic of discussion is going to be the LEARNS Act. Governor Sanders has proposed a $109 million spending growth over the last year. About $100 million of that uh, is all because of the LEARNS Act, uh, the major education overhaul that lawmakers passed last year. Republican State Senator Brian King says the finances of the LEARNS Act has been a top concern of his. If there's not a big rebound in the economy, in, across the state in Arkansas, I think it's very concerning that we're not going to meet the financial obligations to what's been promised. State Senator Letting says parents across the state have concerns about the Education Freedom Account program. He says through the LEARNS Act, the state is taking money away from public schools and sending it to private schools. State's top priority has to be uh, strong public education and access to public education for students all across the state. Lawmakers can propose non-budget related bills during this session too. It may provide a chance to repeal a law dealing with cryptocurrency mining. Cryptocurrency mines are data centers requiring large amounts of computing power and electricity. They put these crypto mines in rural areas over here and they're sucking more water out of Beaver Lake then they need to know that, hey, it's going to be detrimental to them in the long run while they're not creating jobs. They're really job destroyers. According to State Senator King, the backlash is due to local government's inability to regulate these cryptocurrency mines. He says he wants to put things in place that would allow the state to know exactly what the cryptocurrency mines are doing in our state. Christina Randall, Fox 24 News.